When you approach a motionless person, check for responsiveness. Hey, are you okay? If unresponsive, call 911. Send a bystander to call 911. Use the head tilt chin lift method to open the airway. Look, listen, and feel for signs of normal breathing for up to 10 seconds. If breathing is absent, pinch the victim's nose and give two slow breaths. Each breath should last one and a half to two seconds and make the victim's chest rise. Once your breaths go in, check for signs of circulation, such as breathing, coughing, or movement for up to 10 seconds. If there are no signs of circulation, begin CPR. This is a combination of chest compressions and rescue breaths. To give chest compressions, place your hands on the lower half of the sternum between the nipples. An optional method is to slide your fingers along the lower ribs to the point where the ribs meet at the base of the sternum. Place the heel of your hand above your fingers. Place your other hand on top of the first One, hand. Two. With your arms straight and shoulders directly over your hands, depress the chest one and a half to two inches and then allow the chest to return to its normal position. Give 15 compressions at a rate of about 100 compressions per minute. After 15 chest compressions, give two slow rescue breaths. Repeat the cycles of CPR, giving 15 chest compressions and two rescue breaths for one minute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. After one minute, recheck the victim for signs of circulation. If there are still no signs of circulation, continue CPR, beginning with chest compressions. One, two, 